The gas shortage, that's just one of the major issues that civic leaders will be looking at when they start to review the lessons learned from Hurricane Rita. KPRC Local 2 reporter Priscilla Kwan has the very latest progress report from city leaders. With more than two months left in the hurricane season, the leaders here said that this provided a critical lesson in how to work together in the federal, state, and local levels. One day after Hurricane Rita struck the Gulf, Houston area leaders said they are thankful its destructive power missed Houston. A sigh of relief that the nation's fourth largest city didn't see the suffering that was inflicted on brothers and sisters and Lake Charles in western Louisiana. Center Point Energy employees are making progress with their cleanup efforts. They're removing tree limbs and repairing downed power lines. We appreciate the public's patience as we work to restore power. We ask initially that the public not call us, customers not call to report power outages because we're very aware of where the power outages are. With widespread gas shortages still plaguing the Houston area, the mayor sent a clear message to gas stations. Open if you can. There is some fuel available in tankers, but it can't deliver it if you're not there. And your fellow citizens of this region are counting on you uh, to show up to work. Center Point Energy said at its peak, more than 700,000 customers were without power. Now more than half of those customers have their power restored. The leaders here say the damage estimates in this area is in the tens of millions of dollars. Reporting from North Houston, I'm Priscilla Kwan, KPRC Local 2.